Hit and runs are on the rise all across the valley, and six people have been killed in hit and run crashes over the past three months, compared to 10 throughout last year as a whole. Thanks for joining us here at 5. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. Now, video you're seeing right here is from crashes just last week. Now, police are asking for the public's help in solving two of these cases. Reporter Kate Houston is live right near Paradise in Twain. That is where one of those crashes happened, Kate. Yes, that's right. Now, Metro Police say that they want to break this trend. They say that in both of these cases, the drivers fled the scene, leaving pedestrians to die on the side of the road. If they stayed right here and helped, they wouldn't have been charged. These are people, and they're dying on our roadways, laying there, bleeding to death, dying, and nobody did anything to stop them. Metro Lieutenant Greg Munson is pleading to the community after six people died from hit and run crashes, two of which have not been solved. These families need closure. These families need justice. And the people that are responsible need to face the consequences of their actions. Police are searching for this burgundy SUV, saying it was involved in a hit and run crash on February 20th on Palos Verdes near Twain and Paradise. A 63 year old man was walking near that crosswalk and was hit and killed. The second death happened on March 14th on Lincoln near Lake Mead and Lamb when a man in his 50s darted across oncoming traffic and was hit. Police are searching for a 2007 to 2009 gray Toyota Camry that was involved. Both of these drivers left the scene, and both of these drivers, if they, if they would have stayed on scene, were not at fault in this collision. But now they're looking at serious felony charges. Now Metro is asking anyone with information to come forward so they can bring these families closure. Somebody knows something. A person doesn't just hit and kill somebody on a road and remain completely silent. Somebody's friend, their family, their coworker knows that they did this. Now back out live, that first crash did happen right near this intersection. If you have any information, anonymous tips can be made through Crime Stoppers. The LVMPD Traffic Bureau is also taking tips on their Facebook page through Messenger. Reporting live near Paradise in Twain, Kate Houston, 8 News Now.